Welcome back. As you said, we are going to look at how to select a lender. Yes. When you invest in real estate, you should use the services of a mortgage broker. The investment community does not fit quite so neatly into the big 5 seconds criteria for mortgage lending. They usually want to lend or triple a bonuses and lend on it to triple a products. Find a mortgage broker who can deal with 20 or 30 different lenders and who has access to private money. Okay so, what are the necessary processes in selecting a lender? First, consider their experience. When searching for a mortgage broker, take a look at their experience and their ability to fund investments. How do they proceed in the investment market and what is their attitude towards working with investors? You need someone on your side when you want to ask for money. 2. Review their funding methods. Choose a mortgage broker carefully so they can secure the funding you require in the manner you desire. Will a mortgage broker secure fundings for your properties? Obviously they may use conventional lenders such as banks and trust companies. However, they may also have access to pension funds or union pension funds or to mortgage investment funds. They should have access to real estate syndication funds, relationships with community banks, and they should have private lenders on their side in case they require more money to close. 3. Prepare to pay fees for a private or commercial funding. When you first venture into commercial investment properties, expect to pay a fee for the service. These fees are above the purchase price itself, so calculate these fees in your closing costs. Thank you. Next time, we are going to look at how to select a building inspector.